so Nadia right here and I am going to share you my planning planner <laughs> I know planner is supposed to be like a planning but you know everybody has the purpose on in each and type of planner they want so so this is a uh, file effects planner in stone that's the color and the name of this planner it's Malden okay file effects Malden it's really nice I love it I've talked through about it uh, previous video so just gonna hop on everything else um, okay so this is the Oli clip I just decorated it if you don't know what Oli clip Oli clip is just like a clip a magnetic clip okay so if you're a Malaysian if you want to buy please don't buy yourself because it's gonna like take all your money because the shipping is just too expensive okay if you want to buy please contact the buku girl on Instagram and DM her because she always opened this group buy thingy so yeah look for her if you guys want to buy this all clip okay the link will also I will you know list it down below there so you guys can find okay so what do I have inside so this is just mainly for decoration um, it's actually from simply gilded okay so simply gilded and it's a magnetic as well so what I did is I put in another magnet inside here that I buy oops where is it oh there you go I think it's from Daiso yeah it's Daiso so and then I'm just gonna like stick it in and it would not drop oops sorry yeah there you go so it stays okay inside here I have nothing I have nothing inside here just one piece of picture of my swan that's why I call my planner or that okay anyway um, right here I have just a vinyl this is from my shop you can check them out if you like okay and I'm just gonna show you guys I love this I love my front pocket so so much because this is functional I can say because I've been trying to how do I decorate Malden pocket secretary pockets in front so I don't want to be like you know adding more bulk to my planner because if you see Odette's first video it's, it's pretty bulk because that time I was in the mood in all this decoration but now I just want it functional so I've been thinking and I saw a person who put cards in it with like section I don't know what what she did because it's just one I just saw it at the glance on stories so I was thinking like oh why not we make a doa card doa card is just like a prayer card I mean it's just a remembrance of um, like uh, from the Quran it's a quote from a Quran and you know you recite it so that's why I did uh, everything inside so I have like remembrance so you have la ilaha illallah in front and I have protection so this is Ayat Kursi and your heart is this uh, Ali class and I have because I have major anxiety oh, I hate that when it comes so I have to you know I, it's all that I have to it's just that you know when you recite you feel calm so that's what I do uh, and then I have my more risky and then like for peace yeah and you know I really love this card so I just put it in front for functional usage so if let's say today I feel really really uh, sad or what I'm just gonna read this for today not bad okay yeah I did because oh, it's hard to get in because I uh, how to say I I didn't measure it well that's why so it's just in front there and this you guys it's the dashboard remember this is a dashboard this is a divider divider with tabs is what we call dividers okay guys okay so in my planner I have five section which is the dividers and in front mainly is just for 
here are the glands okay uh, I just have Odin's name and I have my name this is the vinyl for my shop and this is a dashboard acetate from GP studio uh, subscription box that's no longer in the market I don't know why I think I think she should stop okay so there's no longer in the market and I this one is from SM Plants uh, on Etsy, you can find them. This is just a year at a glance. And this is from Peanuts Planner Co. So if you guys know my planner, uh, insert, everything is just from Peanuts Planner Co. Post Paper Rock and some other uh, yeah, insert maker. Okay, so there's a lot of Peanuts Planner Co. inside here. I don't PR for her, but you know, Barbara made such a good job, so I just love using her inserts. So I have uh, inbox. Um, I don't use that much. I don't know why. Because I just wanted to have something to write, but I don't want to put it in here, so end up I'm using a sticky note. Yeah, it's just somewhere here. Okay, so I have my inbox, some stuff I've added, and this is the index of the previous planner, but I just have it in here because I just love it. I just love to see it in here, so that's why I still have it. And they have all of my routines. You guys can watch my other video. Uh, I talk about it because this is what uh, I made. I made myself using uh, words, Microsoft words, and yeah. And then I just have uh, a picture of me and my boyfriend, and yeah. And this dashboard uh, is like a glitter dashboard. I bought it from Chibi Plants on Instagram. Sometimes she do open orders, so you guys better watch out. Because sometimes uh, from Malaysia, they ask where you get this, and it's actually international. I don't bought it here, but actually you can make it yourself. But you know, you can't find this glitter in Malaysia, so I just bought it from Chibi plans and yeah so this is just the full year overview of 2019 and I have quotes in front here and if you will see all of my planners I have quotes at the beginning of my planner um, you know just to motivate me so I have some quotes right here and oh yeah I didn't want you guys because you know this video is gonna be lengthy guys so please bear with me and yeah i made this card is actually a journaling card i don't know whether you know about the journaling card it's like four times six inch card you know the card that's <coughs> sorry so i just write onto it and i use this washi tape and then i just cover it it's called a washi card like people use this i don't know why but it's so pretty I love it and then this is from planner press uh, design and I just added some quotes so I love that and this is from her name is Savy and this is a printable on her Facebook group so you guys if you want go get it because it's just so pretty and uh, okay sorry I don't know I think this is from makers duo marma I print it on a vellum. Actually, it's a tracing paper. Guys, don't go popular or MPH if you're in Malaysia and ask for vellum because they do not understand vellum. Just ask for tracing paper, print it on it, and there you go. Vellum. And I also have this vellum. Uh, okay, so I just wanted to note to you guys this section is all of my about my Disney team. Yeah, I'm probably going to Disneyland probably okay please pray for me so <laughs> i have a lot of disney stuff in here uh so the front section is all it's like not always but i have it since last year so i just add more stuff to it about disney so i have this vellum and then this is from 15 april this is also from 15 april i love this kit so so much when it came out i'm just like oh my god i just need it so badly even though i'm broke but you know i still have I need to find money and buy it. So, thank you, Julia, for making this Disney team because I love it. I have a matching stickers, you know. I I bought two of it. It's just somewhere in my stash. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, and then I have uh, the sticky notes as well. See, it's all matching, 
and then this just this is actually the first card that I got uh, last year and then this year she opened up the kit uh, for the whole bundle things uh, yeah and then it's for uh, planner press see I told you that you can make your uh, glitter dash for yourself but you know it takes time because I don't know guys if you want to try good luck because it will damage your your laminator because I damage mine <laughs> that's just an uh, heads up okay and I have Surah Al-Fatiha in here because in an opener Surah in Quran the Holy Quran so I have it also in my planner uh, I supposed to change this but you know I love it so much because it looks crumple and like a doggy ears things but you know I like it uh, it looks that I'm always open my uh, it looks like I always open up my planner in like if it's too how to say it, uh, you know clean and that kind of thing that means I'm just you know I'm not using my planner so if it's like this I know I'm using it and this is from I'm sorry if it's wrong but I think it's from craft stationery I think but because they, they have this cute little uh, you know I posted it on my Instagram but I forgot the name so yeah and I have like cup bar and yeah some day work with the no on it and then this is just pocket that I made and then from a happy scrappy uh, digitals okay so this section is my goal section yeah every time in my planner i always have a goal section oh sorry guys sorry okay i'm back so this is a goal section it's actually a printout from uh peanuts planner co i love this fold out because i can write down all of my achievement even though it's not like specific that I won but it already happened so I really I used to write this uh, two years ago so why not 2019 I'll write it again and I put some uh, stickers and this is a sticker from my shop this is a sticker from paper geeko I have a code for it Nadia 15 if you guys are interested paper geeko okay you guys I have something to tell I PR a lot and I use a lot uh, Instagram or IG shop that start with the letter P like Paper Geeko, Planner Press uh, Paper Dorable and then I have Peanuts Planner Co I mean all start with P I just do not know why maybe it's because it symbolizes planner yeah that kind of thing so I have my uh, resolution so this is the main focus uh, in 2019 I have it um, you know, saving, uh, tajud every morning, and that's prayer, and cleaning and declutter things. I do that since January, you know. And then I have like travel, so I, I go travels a lot this year. And my priority is saving. I'll do another video about saving because I have another planner for savings. So you guys better check that out. Um, stay tuned about that. So this is like my goal planning and things like that. Uh, I'm not gonna show you in details because that's really private. Okay, so now we are going to the sections that I'm going to talk about. So my first section will be monthly, okay? For previously, I have actually two monthly. I mean, first monthly is just an overview. So I have some, you know, this is from Happy Scrappy and whatnot. Okay, Peanuts Planner Co. freebies you can get on Facebook. Um, this is how I plan my monthlies. I have a tutoring class that I teach. I teach kids from primary to secondary and these are the times that I need to look at and I have stick all the stickers from Gotli Studio see all this holidays in Malaysia okay guys holidays in Malaysia is just epic because you have it every month and school holidays as well that's the yellow color if you you know the calendar kuda the classic very classic calendar that's where I get all the information so I have it like all until December that's when the school holiday starts yeah and yeah I write down every appointments in here 
uh, you know, holidays and whatnot. And I'm going vacation and you know, planner meetups. There's so much things going on. Uh, that's why I always tell my friends, please tell me uh, at least two months earlier. I mean, sorry, two weeks earlier so that I can note down in my planner because uh, my tutoring class is always end up in uh, Saturday and Sunday. So I'll be really, really full. And my only rest days are on Wednesday, that's today, and Friday. So, yeah. That's how it goes. Okay, and this is a dashboard that I made uh, for my my shop. If you guys are interested, from Legion, and uh, this is just my cleaning stuff that I am working on before because Ramadan starts next month, so I have to get ready the house because I just I, I just need to declutter before we enter Ramadan that's just how I feel because last year it was a mess and when we are fasting we can't actually do any much things so I learned my lesson actually I just need to clean every single day but you know you don't have time guys time is very limited so that's what it is yeah I, I'm going to have another Ramadan setup um, be sure to check that out as well um, yeah, so this is what I always plan and you know some notes I just write it down here and So big exams are coming up Yeah, so that's just my monthly so I have another Monthly overview which is all of my goal tasks. Okay, I'm just gonna talk about my full task and goals in month Okay, I haven't done for April. This is for April. This insert is from peanuts. I'm oh, sorry. See? It's from Bose Paper Art, sorry. Bose Paper Art, I custom it myself from Lynn. So you guys can get similar from her Etsy and print out yourself. Uh, so I have like personal, ongoing tasks, important project list, home, finance, family, shop, and work. So I, I always write down things that I want to do in this month so that it's already in categorized list and I really like it. I think I've talked about it in my previous video. You guys can check them out. But this is how I decorate it. So this is using p uh, paper deco washi tape. See? It's very beautiful when you lay it out. Really beautiful. Okay. And so my next section is all, all about weekly. So guys, please pay attention to this into details how I plan I know it's complex but you know everybody have their own planning style you know people have their own system this is mine <laughs> okay so this weekly mainly purpose is for my tutor class and you know I have a lot not to say a lot but I have kids that you know sometimes they don't they they are absent on the day and I have to track down uh, cl uh, the class cancelled and replacement class so that kind of thing and this represent all the Chegu outside there Chegu is teacher so this is from Dari Sini Kebintang yeah that's her IG name I'll link down as well so this is from uh, any plans printable that's the cover and inside is mostly penis pentacle cover <laughs> sorry penis pentacle insert and I, I also will link it down because I forgot the DR uh, I think it oh DR60 so you can find it on website about this okay so this is how normally is just uh, tracking my days my tutoring days and whatnot so yeah and this is from press it's a digital download and then I just made it like a top tabs you know for today and stuff yeah so I have it for the rest of the year half of it is another planner so yeah and then this is just a dashboard for a section so this is mainly it's just similar as the weekly but this is more likely to have like planning out the weeks I'm just making it into weeklies and this one okay 
you're gonna be confused with me. Follow me, guys. Sorry. This is an insert from Mon Weekly My Summer Touch. Okay, my Summer Touch made this insert, and it's very, very functional. I can say it's very very functional. I love it so so much because why is it called mind weeklies? Because you can see your mind and you can see your weeklies as well. So I plan it out like that. And this is another insert that she made. It's the dailies as well. So you can find it in her Etsy shop because this is such a brilliant. I love it so so much. I've been seeing a lot of these things and I like it. I really like it. I don't know about you, but I like it so much. So why I like it? Because you can see, sorry guys. <laughs> because you can see your mind. I know I already have the month and yearly event in front here. But why do I need to see this? Because one thing, this is like my plannings of everything. Not just about lesson plans, but you know, I I also include some other personal stuff beside from the tutoring and you know class teaching and that kind of thing. So I also use it as my lesson plans and what I want to teach, and I have it like all written down. Actually, I have another, so that's why I just I just printed it out and you know and start on this week. Yeah, so I I write it out. Uh, a lot of things and you know I plan it out and you know that you can see a lot of things right here if I want to plan it out like you know this class I can I cannot come or you know this class couldn't be that kind of thing so I can plan it out so and it's easier also for me to do uh, planner meetups because I can shift a lot of things yeah that's that's the main purpose and I really like it and I am going I'm continuing it until right today so let me close this for a while and then I open this up this is for April I love it so so much okay this is for this week so I already have it written down and I have my daily stuff right here um, because this came stand alone you print this alone without this insert but you know I'm I made it like together so that you know I can shift back and whatnot because I like it so much and you know if I have things I just write it down for the next month and also there's this the new thing I have the goals in front here because last time I think I didn't do anything in front but I have right here uh, my goals for April that I want to accomplish before me which is I already told you about the Ramadan um, mine so I'm preparing for that yeah I really like it thank you so much from my summer touch that made this insert because they are such a lovely insert the next section we are going uh, into is my follow-up I know I didn't write anything but yeah so a uh, section is about follow-up so follow-up means um, my health so I will release down what I, you know, I have sickness, cough, flu, um, stomach ache, headaches, that kind of thing. Also, I'm just gonna put it down. You know, you don't, you never know when you're gonna trace it back. So that's why I have it in here. And this section is my ibadah tracker. Uh, ibadah tracker means I track my salat. Okay, I track my salat. So what I do is I'm using Peanuts Pineapple Insert. Uh, this type of grid, I don't, I can't remember the code, but I will try and link it down. Uh, so it, it goes to uh, each year, sorry, each month for twelve months straight, and you have one, two, three, four, five, six. So six boxes right here. So I segregate it as like uh, first is Fajar. So you have five times a day to pray. So Fajar, um, and then Zohor, Asar, Maghrib, Isha, and this is specifically for my Tajr. Tajr is just a Sunnah prayer. So, yeah, 
that one so I've been tracking this since last year I am so proud of myself you know even though I have missed it somehow but you know you can replace your solar and yeah because what like what Yasmin said Yasmin Mo okay I'm sorry I, I can't remember the last name but Yasmin said it's solar is your spiritual oxygen so yeah no matter what you have to do it so I have it in here as a tracker and I have a 3v series tracker right here I always watch uh, I don't have a television in my house or a smart TV I just have my phone and the internet so I just can watch whenever I want so I just don't follow series that on trend like the drama on TV3 in Malaysia so but I just have then I just want to watch back now Noor because I haven't watched Noor for the first episode yeah uh, I do watch other um, like international TV shows or dramas but you know I stopped because of my hectic life so I stopped watching yeah and I still have my tracker habits tracker um, if you want to know more about this go check out my other videos because I have explained quite yeah in details on how I track my moods I still have it and I don't know what happened in February I stopped and in March I tried a different layout which is I don't have that uh, line the graph of my moods I kinda don't like it March yeah I did this so April I'm starting back with my uh, graph line but I added a little bit different where I change colors we will see because you know sometimes it's just bored when I see it's all black so I'm trying to you know change colors and not trying to just stick to one color <laughs> okay and after my follow-up I have the last section which is my finance so all about my uh, stuff inside here but I do track some stuff let me show you so I track on my planner fields which is whenever I change my insert my setups uh, do I post any videos so I do have this I don't know why but I like it and I also track uh, my yearly personal stuff self-care like when I buy my perfume you know that kind of thing like your foundation makeup stuff um, your dress clothing what kind or not like that so you know I haven't buying anything you know and this is my spending tracker for planners only guys for planners only not food but planners only you can see January I spend quite a lot because I'm actually not a lot I'm just waiting for the December stuff to come in because yeah I I have no spend in January so yeah this is all the things that I bought in December so it's just like shifting so February I did a really good job but you know I did I did still spend some things and I do spend some stuff for March because we are having the planner soiree in Malaysia we have the planner meet uh, for plan addicts so yeah and I have up until there and this is my shop code coupon code you can say I just have it in here I haven't write out anything um, it's from come on I remember just now letters to Sierra I think that's her name Sierra is her name and then I have like the grocery list that I haven't filled out as well um, it's it's a freebie from Peanut Spanner Co. you guys can check it out at Peanut Spanner Co. Facebook group and then okay this is gonna be like a complicated stuff okay let me show you this part first okay this is my income tracker it's pay dates you can see it right there so I tra track my pay dates in here um, I can't read it out <laughs> so yeah using Peanut Spanner Co. and I use almost a lot of things 
from Peanuts Pinnacle Financial Insert. I really like it. I don't know whether you guys want to see another setup. I mean, not not setup like a flip video and telling you guys about my um, financial stuff. But yeah, I have it like here. This is payday. Um, this is my bill tracker, and then I have another section which is I call my uh, cash envelope system that I've been using. I'm using a budget overview as my cash envelope system, so I've been using it for uh, almost yeah March, but I haven't filled up for April yet. So yeah, I always update this um, every time when I get a payday, and this is when I start using this insert I have my budget tracker like all of the things that I need to and then saving stuff yeah I start saving this year I start my goals and yeah this is just nothing um, order stuff this is my spending list that I don't use and this year my main focus is to collect 10k saving wish me luck guys seriously Okay, and then this is like my loan, my uh, student loan that I've been tracking um, at C bills, and then uh, this is what I've been saving for, my Raya money, which is Eid, so I've been saving it since uh, January and February and still going on. And on my vacation and travel stuff, um, emergency fund, I discovered an emergency fund last year, so I thought that it would be great to start emergency fund for this year. This is what I am doing, uh, 12 month money challenge. And yeah, others are just like saving stuff, uh, yeah, budget tracker and that kind of thing. So that's about it. So I have like all of my accounts and I do update it regularly. like. Double Hanji account, I'm gonna Saham, all of that. So, yeah. And I just have like a note pages in case I wanna write stuff, but I don't. I ended up writing some other pages because I love that. <laughs> I love this. Yeah, uh, insert. <laughs> so, yeah. And yeah, I think I almost covered everything of my planning. I hope you're not bored. I hope it's functional and you know and hoping to see you guys in another video wait I have one more to show oh my goodness okay so this is like every day at home you know every day at home <laughs> okay when you see like a EDC it's everyday carry so when you go out and you know you have your grocery list uh, things to buy that kind of thing so you have that so this is the one that I I want to share um, if you see in my planning I don't really have the daily to do's and whatnot because I've changed it to a system which I call this it's a book that I made um, I started in February <coughs> sorry so this is a really small book that I all I write all of my to-do lists and there are days when I just don't write and I don't feel like being adult so yeah I'll just leave it blank I do decorate it with stickers but sometimes I don't just as today so look at that there's no stickers that's just um, tags and that kind of thing so I'll just go back and put stickers in uh, unless if I am really really creative that time so I'll just put stickers right away until whatever that I like so yeah so this is such a handy book if you want to see a tutorial you guys can check it out on my Instagram page that's Skippy Skittle uh, Instagram on my highlights there will be